So and I'm gonna be doing some Jamaican jerk chicken today. Um, so right here, this is some of my natural blending season, which I made myself, homemade natural blending season. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put one, two, Two and a half nice good tablespoon of the jerks of my natural blending season. Now I'm gonna use some jerk seasoning to marinate it. I'm gonna put um one one and a half tablespoon of jerk season. Alright, so the jerk season is different from my natural blending season. If you guys can see what's going on right there. Um also I'm gonna put some all-purpose season, one tablespoon of all-purpose season. I'm gonna put some paprika. So the paprika, definitely gonna give it a lovely color. This is some, um, this is some Sulfury season from the carbon fusion sauce and spice. We're gonna put a tablespoon on it. It's lovely to use. And chicken season. Roughly about half tablespoon. Lovely. Um, we're gonna put some fresh thyme. Just a few fresh thyme on it. Lovely. Um, we're gonna get some spring onion. I'm put some spring onion on it. And that's gonna bring in a nice. Some white onion, which we're gonna be using. Got some fresh garlic. I'm gonna use some fresh garlic. This is some garlic we're gonna use on it, all right? Put some fermented seed on it. We're gonna get some scotch bonnet pepper and put a few slices on it. some we're gonna put some avocado oil on it all right a little bit of avocado oil to give it that lovely flavor and taste all right and what we're going to do we got some ginger I can put a little bit of ginger on it but um, what I'm gonna do, I need to think I need to do this because I think it's gonna be a little bit spicy. Let's put a little bit of black pepper, but I don't want it too spicy because I want them to enjoy it. So basically, I think I'm going to squeeze a little bit of honey to bring in a little bit of sweetness to it, all right? Yeah, because it's gonna be really spicy because that jerk season is very spicy. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna rub him this now. Get this marinated up on nice, but 
hopefully they will enjoy it. It's just to marinate it up for them and get this marinade up and brown up on the color and the texture is lovely. Only thing I would do, yeah, I would put a pinch of food coloring, browning on it to give it a little bit of color. Just a tiny bit, not much. Because I don't like it when it, I like to see meat with a little bit of color. Don't use too much, just a tiny bit. And it's gonna bring in a nice, lovely color to the meat. So as you can see, that's looking a little much better. All right. Ah, oh, smell amazing. The flavor, the texture is so beautiful, guys. Honestly, um, I would encourage you to watch the full video on my YouTube channel, Chef for Color Cooking. That's where it's gonna be. How to do this on an amazing, credible um, chicken right here. All right. Yeah. But um, as you guys can see. All right. That is excellent. And an amazing. All right. Look at the color, and the texture of this fantastic. And amazing this is some real authentic jamaican jerk chicken right here all right beautiful the video on my youtube channel chef ricardo cooking all right yeah man go over and watch the full recipe all right so here it is another video from chef ricardo cooking today guys for you hope you guys will enjoy it so we're gonna leave this for 24 hours for it to soak and you know i mean get the meat proper soak into this with the season and everything it's gonna be beautiful yeah it's gonna be fantastic and an amazing look at that so that's looking good guys lovely and delicious if you like the if you like the video please leave your comments in the description box please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend all right we've got a lot more recipes and a lot more ideas for you guys to do some chicken recipe at home Stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.